might be spending a lot many time giving us so much of effort and uh, few of you uh, not getting the, the, the right way uh, this uh, the way you wanted to express yourself and the things are not turning up so you might have uh, some bit of uh, you know uh, the frustration uh, that and a lot of question within you uh, why I'm not improving how to learn watercolor uh, such kind of many questions might be coming into your head every time uh, <laughs> because uh, I completely understand and uh, given the fact that I'm getting a lot of queries and uh, across the world uh, so I just thought that you know, what is the best way I can convince you uh, the learning this uh, uh, magnificent medium so what is the best way to learn watercolor how to improve one uh, you know going forward with the watercolor uh, my only suggestion uh, to learn watercolor is uh, Nobody can teach you watercolor. Nobody can teach you anything. I mean, <coughs> we all know that. Okay. What really teaches you your desire, your your passion, and how deeply you wanted to learn the technique, how deeply you are connected. So you just ask yourself, you know, you just ask your your inner desire that do you really want to learn watercolor? And let's listen then, and just listen. You'll get a uh, one a very genuine answer from from within you. And you'll say yes, or probably no, right? Or probably maybe this is just a hobby for me. So you need to prioritize. You just you know look at yourself and ask this question, and get the right answer from you. If the answer is yes, I want to learn you watercolor, you'll always start thinking positive way to learn watercolor. A lot of people are saying uh, the watercolor is just so tough, uh, you know, it's uh, so much complicated. The handling the water and uh, uh, you know the the overall uh, the uh, overall composition of the watercolor, it's very it's very complicated for me. I'm really not able to get this medium. The moment you are saying that uh, it's a complicated, that means you are not passionate about it. Okay. So first, you need to very much clear with yourself: Do you really want to learn? If the answer is yes, there are a lot of questions. There is a lot of answer. There are all positive energy which comes to you, and it will say, "Okay, hey." You know, it's very simple. There is nothing hard in it. Okay. And you will start finding the way to learn watercolor. You will start discovering yourself that, okay, what is the way? What should I learn? What is the first step I need to take? Okay. Should I, should I learn the basic sketching first or composition first? And then I should go into the very basic watercoloring. So those question and answer you'll be getting with yourself. You really don't need to go anywhere and asking this question. A lot of people are asking me, what this paper, what this brush, what this color? Trust me, it doesn't matter. Why you really need to know about the art supplies? You really don't need to. Whichever paper you have, whichever the color or the brush you have, you just start. What you need to do is you need to improve your skill, your desire. And then you will see that how significant changes comes to you in a, in a certain time. And be very faithful to your desire. We know that everybody wants to, you know, uh, become Everyone has some desire, some, some goal. So what is your goal? Among all your goal, is that the goal which is the most priority in your life? So just look at those first. Be very clear that what you do, what you want to do, do you really want to learn? And if you have, if you see that if there is any, you know, 
the double thought in it, then probably I would say that you just go back and just take a deep introspection and just ask yourself. Okay, so this is the, the, the very preliminary level of, uh, you know, uh, you know, the task which you have to do. Okay, and then you go into the, all the basics and uh, you really, I mean, as I said, I mean, you really don't need to, uh, you know, the figure on how to learn whatever. You himself, from you, from you, the answer will be keep generating. And it's say, ki, hey, you know, you have to go there and just see that what's happening. Okay, and the step by step, all the necessary, you know, uh, the process which you will be start following. So the desire is the so much important here. So generate those desire, the passion. So a lot of people are asking me, Nithin, what's your journey with the watercolor? How you've been doing with the watercolor? How did you get to learn this? And uh, it's really fascinating to to you know to tell your story, uh, how excitement uh, uh, it is, uh, and it all happened the because of my desire. My desire was to be a watercolor. And the day I realized that uh, you know I wanted to go ahead with the watercolor, only the positive side came into in my mind. I had a very tough time to learn watercolor, but I never call it as a tough. It was a phase, it was a phase of excitement. It was a phase of learning and figuring out how to, you know, to overcome if I have any, any roadblocks or any, any hurdles which came in my way. So my journey as an artist, as a, as a watercolor was a full, of, full of excitement. Uh, You'll be very, uh, you know, surprised to know that uh, I couldn't paint for 13 years uh, and that was the kind of, uh, uh, it's, a, it's a very sad uh, thing <laughs> which happened to me. Uh, in fact, I've uh, written a book about it. It's an e-book. It's a very small e-book. If you want to uh, read it, uh, you can visit my Etsy store. I'll just give you a link. Probably you can go and uh, download this version. It's uh, it's about four to five dollar. So you will understand the my story about uh, uh, as a as a watercolor artist. Uh, so it happens. It happens to um, every artist. It's all about. Uh, it's all about to what you want to be, what's your, uh, you know, what what's your desire, what you want to be, what you want to do, uh, and what really excites you, what brings a big smile to your face, right? And uh, there's a there is a various aspect of it. I'm an auto psychologist, and uh, those just <laughs> you know, I, I can't. Uh, I can't just explain in a words, but uh, yeah, it's a kind of feeling which uh, uh, which every individuals get. And if you are succeed what you want to be, then uh, you only can say that uh, how pleasant it is. So if you are learning watercolor and uh, if you are going through uh, some uh, rough time with a watercolor, don't just be heartless. Just go with it. Go with it without having any doubt in you. Keep going. Keep going and keep working whatever it is and however it is. Be happy with that. After a certain time, you'll realize you know, how excitement the journey was. You'll be telling your story to your family and friends how excitement uh, it was to learn to learn watercolor. So preserve those memories with you all the paintings you are doing today and uh, you know and that's your memory so thank you so much everyone i hope you understand what i want to convince you uh, so my best wishes to everyone all the beginners and the watercolor artists uh, for your success or uh, with your journey i especially want to say thank you to all my patreon uh, who's been helping me uh, to create a watercolor tutorial, I'm just trying to create many more of this. 
So your support is so important for me. So thank you so much everyone who has been supporting me. Take care of yourself. I will see you soon. Thank you.